Hello and thank you for making yourself available for this interview. Let's just, well, jump right in, shall we? What, what is your opinion as a Muslim um, on the Shia? Who? The Shia? No, they are not real Muslims. They disrespect the companions and Aisha, mother of believers. Well, then, what about the Sufis? No, no, no. Of course, they are not real Muslims. They play musical instruments and that's haram. Okay, but what about the Ahmadiyya? No, they are not real Muslims. They have been blinded to the truth by a lying Dajjal. Okay, thank you for that. What about Wahhabis? No, no, they are not real Muslims because they, they misinterpret the Quran. We are a religion of peace. And I hate to ask, what, what do you think of the Taliban? No, they are not real Muslims. Islam is the champion of women's yes, rights. Yes, 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 of course. What, what do you think of the Muslim Brotherhood then? They are not real Muslims. Their views do not represent Islam. Okay, and then what about Daesh, the, the ISIS, ISIL people and their actions in Syria and Iraq? Of course, they are not true Muslims. Their actions go against Islam. How many times do I have to repeat we are a religion of peace. Okay, but then what do you think of those suicide bombers who blow themselves up in the name of Islam? Well, the Shias deserve it. I, I mean, no, no, of course, they are not real Muslims. Islam is peace. Let's change it slightly. Why are most Islamic countries backward in your eyes in regards to science and technology and progress? Hey, hey we invented the internet. Uh, no, you didn't. Okay, okay, we didn't. But we are not making scientific discoveries because Muslims do not follow Islam properly or understand the miracles in the Quran. Okay, but then what are the problems of forced marriages, child marriages, lashing, whipping, beating, stoning and forcing the veil, executions for apostasy and well, blasphemy, prevalent in some Islamic communities even today. Those actions are not from Islam. These are all lies and fabrications and those who do them are not true Muslims. Ah, all right. But then what do you say of the Hadiths that advocate and support these executions for apostasy and fighting non-believers? And what about all the, the numerous tafsirs and sources written by Muslim scholars, and including those who establish the major Islamic schools of jurisprudence? Um, no, they are all false. They are not truly from Islam. And those scholars who wrote this have misunderstood what the real teachings of Islam are. Yes, 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 of course. But then, how many Muslims are there? Yes, Allahu Akbar. Islam is the fastest growing and most widespread religion in the world. We are the Ummah of more than 1.7 billion followers. Allahu Akbar. All right, thank you very much for the interview.